everyone. This is Braden here from VoiceFlow, and today we're, we are going to get started with the VoiceFlow tool, and we can begin to build our own Alexa skills without having to write any code. So let's, uh, let's log in. First, you can see we are at getvoiceflow.com. This is our website. Uh, and you can see it's, you know, it's very nice looking. Kudos to Mike for putting it together. And when you want to log in, if you already have an account, you go up to the top right and hit log in. Otherwise, you can hit get started up here or also get started down here. I'm going to hit get started. Okay, so we are on the sign up page here. And what I'm going to do is put in my name. Uh, I already have an account. Uh, I'm actually going to put in a new account, my old school email. Okay, I'm going to actually make it a different variation. And then I'm going to create my account. Okay, so we are in. Now I'm going to use VoiceFlow for my own personal Alexa skills. I'm going to publish to the store, uh, but I'm not going to use them for work, so I'm going to hit personal. And we are right in. So here you can see Michael's popping up, and we have this uh, amazing help su uh, support center in the bottom right. So you can always talk to one of our staff members, and we'll be able to help you as soon as we possibly can. But I'm going to close that for now. So what you'll see here is this is the dashboard. This is like the home base for all of your Alexa skill building with VoiceFlow. And normally this would be filled with all the different skills that you have made. But we haven't made any skills as this is the first time we've logged in. So let's actually get to starting our own skill. So I'm gonna to go to create skill. And you'll see here, I can uh, put something in. I'm gonna call this test skill. I hit create skill and we are in. Now, there, <laughs> Michael's popping up again. I'm going to close this. Now, you might see there's a lot of stuff going on, and I'm going to take a few, couple minutes to explain what's actually, you know, what's on the screen. So first off, this area that you can move around is called the canvas. And this is where you'll actually be building your Alexa skill by uh, linking these blocks together to actually create a conversation between your users and Alexa. So. Let's actually uh, drag a block in, and you can see there's a speed block. I can drag it and drop it onto the canvas, and just like that, you're able to uh, program Alexa to actually speak. Now, there is a lot going on, so I'm actually going to delete all of this by holding shift, click, and drag, and I'm going to delete that. And now you'll see we just have this start block. Now, what the start block is, is this is where the conversation between Alexa and your user will start. So when you say Alexa, open test skill, it's going to start from the start block and flow from there. So we could do something like drag a speak block out. And we can actually type in here to choose what Alexa will say to the user. I'll say, hello there. Nice to meet you. I'm nice to meet you. I am Alexa. We can actually connect these blocks together. And just like that, we have our very first functioning skill. And so I can save this up here. You'll see we have a top bar with a bunch of different menu options. Like we can upload to Alexa, we can access our account, we can publish to the Alexa store, we can access settings, and we can even share our skill. And then on the left here, you'll see we have a whole bunch of blocks that you can access and use, from functional blocks to advanced blocks to basic blocks. Uh, pretty much everything that you can do with custom code for coding an Alexa skill, you can do with VoiceFlow. So we're actually going to save this and hit test. And you'll see our testing tool opens, which simulates an Alexa. We'll say start from beginning. And there you go. That's what our skill right now says to the user. Hi there. Nice to meet you. I'm Alexa. And of course, this is a very basic skill, but you could create something incredibly complex, like all the skills that you see on the store, you can make with VoiceFlow for free. Okay, so let's go back to our dashboard, and you'll see there's our new test skill popping up. Now, thank you for joining me in this video. In the next video, we're actually going to get Alexa to do a very basic skill, and we'll link it up to actually test on the device. I'm so excited, I'll see you there.